Hello and welcome to today's video, where we'll be showing you some of the simple steps to digitizing your old photos using just the apps on your Android phone. There are three different methods that you can use to digitize your old photos for safekeeping and sharing. Google offers a few good options for scanning super high quality copies of your photos using Google built apps and docs, but also just as easy to copy your images with your camera alone. In this video, we'll be using the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 Plus, but all of these techniques will also work on any Android with up-to-date operating systems and an internet connection for the Google Drive app. To take a simple copy of your photograph, you can snap a picture just using your camera. This method is highly effective, but also takes a few tries to get right. Lighting, movement and angle can affect the overall quality, meaning you could get a blurry or distorted photo. To take the best image, place your photo on a flat surface in an evenly lit, bright room and hold your phone over the image, taking care not to angle the phone as this could warp the photo. It will take a few tries, but if you follow these easy tips, you can get the perfect photo with no hassle at all. The best part about this method is that you can edit, zoom in and share your image within the phone's photo editing settings, making it look even better than the original. Other than taking a photo, the best option to use is the PhotoScan app by Google Photos. The app can be purchased from both the Google Play and App Stores on both Android and iOS, making it compatible across all handsets. It's easy to use and works in a similar fashion to the scan documents in Notes on an iPhone, scanning the image at the corners and digitizing the image with no glare or reflections. Simply download and open the app. Hold your phone directly over the image as straight as possible, then press the white circle to take the photo. You'll see four circles appear over the image. Move the camera over the circles to highlight them and once complete, it will save the scan photo to your camera roll to edit as normal. It is a highly advanced system and depending on the quality of your camera, you can get an almost exact copy of your image to edit and manipulate in any way that you choose. As a Google product, you can also batch share images with friends and family through Google outlets, email and even text, making it easier than ever to share your memories with others. The other scanning option Google has made available with no cost is the scan feature in Google Drive. Though built to scan documents, you can use this feature to replicate your photos with just a few taps. The only problem with this feature is it does seem to take on all of the faults of scanning your photos with your camera or a document scanner. It can take a few tries to get right depending on the angle, lighting or settings. I've tried this a few times and each attempt comes up with different results. But with a few tweaks to the settings, I've managed to get a decent scan of the image that I could screenshot and save just as I would with the Notes app on an iPhone. Of course, as you're already in Google Drive, you can save the image straight to your online storage, reducing the risk of losing the copy on your phone over time and letting you label images and organize them into folders for the perfect digital library. So that's all there is on how to scan your photos using just your Android smartphone. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more daily content on the latest smartphone accessory news and reviews. Thanks for watching.